Hello, hi, it is Monday night, March 25th. I was just looking through my camera roll. I was watching some videos from the last Noah concert, which was in August last year. Tomorrow, we're going to see him play a sold out show at Rogers Arena and it doesn't feel real. I'm trying to process it right now and I don't think it's going to hit me until I see him on stage tomorrow. But I also like it, no, like it doesn't feel like it's tomorrow. It hasn't hit me. We are the first stop for the North American leg this year. So we don't know what's going on. We don't know the set list. What if he added a whole batch of new songs? He has a B stage too, which we also just remembered. We all have floor seats. So pit, GA, whatever you want to call it. We, as in me, Jake, Sammy, Lana, and Sammy's friend, Natalie, we're all going tomorrow together. But I just wanted to vlog this right now because I was just freaking out about the fact that it's tomorrow. Oh my God. I already bought my merch pre-bought it. Sammy and I bought it the other day, like last week actually, because they had their pre-order thing or whatever. Apparently people internationally can order from Vancouver store too, which is kind of strange. I got my merch. I'm fine. I'm happy with it. I'll show you when I get it tomorrow. <coughs> That's it for tonight. We're going to watch The Bachelor soon. Finale night. Woohoo! Yay! <coughs> it is Tuesday, March 26th and today we get to see Noah! I'm so excited. Uh, we are going to pick up Jake and then we are gonna head downtown. And right now the weather's okay. Earlier it was like hailing. Uh, I don't know what's going on in Vancouver, but I'm so excited. We're gonna go downtown and meet up with Sammy um, and everyone else. And then uh, doors are gonna open at 6.30. It is about 5.45 right now. I'm so, so, so excited. I ah! Even though we just saw it now in August. But I love this man and his art and everything and been following his journey forever and so I'm so 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 excited and uh, let's go. Who are we going to see? Someone. Oh. I don't know. <laughs> um, we have to drop our jackets in the car and leave it because uh, we're not carrying it. We have GA. Um, and I'm trying to hold everything in my body to not say the cold word. Um, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> we are. We walked a mile shortly out of breath, but that's okay. Um, we're gonna find Sammy and them. I think they're over here. I also want to show you all the merch truck because oh, they're letting people in already. They're letting people in. Oh my god, I'm excited! Yay! Are you kidding? Mer merch truck. He has a freaking merch truck. What? You're kidding! Hi! <laughs> wait, wait. There's so many people! So Hi! Hi, friends! <laughs> so, welcome to the lineup, y'all. Uh, I thought they would have. <laughs> Stop! I gotta. Hi, girly! <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Anyways, the Noah sign is not up, but uh, that's okay. They'll probably have it inside. So, Jake has all the tickets. If you remember, we literally were in Victoria buying these tickets while eating croissants. Yay! Go to the floor? You no, know, I, so I think we're, they just let, all let everyone in, but we can't go to the floor yet. Um, strange. So honestly, you could line up here, and then just go down, and then you could technically get barricaded, you know what I mean? Anyways, got my earplugs. We're gonna go pick up our merch now. Merch! Bye. Okay, I got my tap water, which will be very necessary later. Um, trying to figure out where to pick up our merch. Say? I don't know if it's this or not. It's this. Okay, I guess we're waiting here. So, this is my first time ordering from the van base pickup thing. Um, yeah, anyways. So they have all of our stuff here. Um, yeah, seems pretty organized for the most part. And here we go. Look at all of our merch. Merch haul, Sammy. Wow. Oh, that's not mine. That's hers. I just got the hoodie. Anyways. Wow. So many things. All the things. <laughs> okay, they're doing a fit haul right here. <laughs> I just wanted to see if it was comfortable. This is uh, Noah's bootlegger shirt, and uh, it's so cute. Sorry. Yes! Send me. Okay, this is a better look at the work. That's a medium? Yeah. Oh, honey. 
That's the same hoodie I got. It has some of the Canada dates on the back. And it's thick, y'all. It's so thick. It's Welcome to Canada. Thick. Yay. It's all the prices are in Canadian dollars. So if you're in the States, going to any other no shows, it'll probably be cheaper. Cheaper. Like $10 cheaper. Yeah. But anywho, everything is pretty average concert price. Nothing is overly expensive or whatnot, but he has set design. I guess. Thank you, Noah. We're in Vermont. Yes. Beast Age, look at the little Beast Age. Ah! Okay, it's hitting me, it's hitting me. I'm scared. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, y'all. Y'all, what is going on? Is that what is going on? Even if we're at like the back of the pit, I'm like, we're crying already. Stop. Even if we're at like the back of the pit, we're still like super close to the stage right now. I'm going to cry. We're just out here crying. We're just out here crying. It's fine. Um, so I think it's about like five, six rows deep right now. We're like five minutes away from the opener. I was fearful and devoted, so romantic, I was hopeless. people and it means that I get a platform to spread a message and uh, I just want to say for this next song if you can look at the person that you came here with tonight please and find something that you fucking hate about them this is your perspective thank you
for seven years to get my pencil grip right and never fucking work. What do you want me to say? I'm just gonna write. Uh, well, I don't know what the fucking write. Oh, what is it? Okay, oh wait, that's a lot of words, fuck. How about I just write my own name? I'm regretting this. What's up? I'm glad you're doing this, but my handwriting is legit fucking horrible. Okay. I love you guys, dude. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Do not put that on your body, but thank you. We're gonna slow it down even more for you guys, real quick. Look at I've been divorced a couple times. You can't see him. 
People are standing up on their chairs.
it's 11.30. Uh, my voice is gone. This is my voice after Noah Khan. Um, the hoodie is very cozy and comfy. I'm very happy. Okay. We're running back to the car and just started downpouring. It's 11.30 and we're probably not going to get home until midnight. And I think we're going to go make some instant noodles because I'm hungry. Hey, hungry. Um, anyways. I'll debrief when we get back so there's some light. You were like, I'm so upset that he opened with Bow Drunk and New Perspective, which are both Jake's songs. It was, it was just, yeah, fast start. <laughs> okay, ear noodles. <laughs> Rated out of 10. Ooh. Seven and a half. Okay. Okay, so we are back now. Um, it's basically midnight at this point. That show, I think, was like two hours long. Um, it felt like he added a bit more songs than last tour. We got Godlight, which had me sobbing. We got Main, which again had me sobbing. Um, and what I wasn't expecting was Youngblood. Um, Youngblood was literally one of the earliest songs that I heard from Noah and I really fell in love with that song and that really was like one of those songs that made me say yep yeah, Noah Khan, great artist <laughs> love his music we're gonna stick through it and follow this man on this musical journey and uh, five years later he played his sold out show at Rogers Arena tonight and uh my ears are still ringing. I had earplugs in in the beginning of the show and then I was like, no, I have to fully hear it. My eardrums are going to regret it, but my entire soul and spirit are fully going to enjoy it and live through those memories. Um, the stage production was so insane. I loved, he has like these little hanging lights that move up and down and change colors and I love that. That was like one of the coolest effects that they had. They had a lot of screens, which is great for the arena size. Um, these are some of the biggest venues that he's playing this time around. And uh, it's so crazy because like back in 2021, it was Jake's first Noah show. And then we got to go see him last year too. And now this is our third one together. And um, Sammy and I have been to five of all five of the Vancouver shows um and yeah so it was just such a big moment for I think everyone to experience it and see it the crowd was actually insane everyone was singing and standing even people in the 300s are standing and that's kind of rare for Vancouver honestly um but it's so nice to see an artist's sort of lyrics be the impactful part of their music because I could see so many people in the crowd singing every single word to every single song and I think that is truly rare too unless you're Taylor Swift or something but um those songs were amazing to hear live I think getting to actually see Noah's face this time around because we stood at the back last show and just like jumped and had fun but tonight we were kind of more so like closer to the like the front of the stage so it was so fun um they had some snow um during northern attitude which was so fun um they had i wasn't expecting confetti but they had like confetti at the end and i was like noah what the heck it was fall stick season vibes so much fun um and i think what's really cool is that noah's audience is so broad he has an older audience. He has a younger audience. He has couples, families, just friend groups. And just his music has related and hit to so many people. And it was just... I was like truly just looking around half the time. Seeing so many fans just having the best time. And you know me. How music impacts people differently. And seeing how Noah's music has impacted so many people across the board. I was literally in shock. And just me being a fan, not even being Noah himself, I can't imagine what it feels like for him 
and yeah I it's hard too because being the first show we didn't really know what to expect we didn't know the set list everything was new so he had a segment for signs um and he was trying to read signs and nobody had a sign in the audience because nobody wanted to be that person so now I think more people are going to bring signs to his show hopefully and he was grabbing gifts from people at the end of the show and in the moment he like goes to B stage he's walking through the audience so if you happen to be on the lower bowl or you're like in the pit or GA or floor or whatever you may get the opportunity to like high five him along the way which I got the chance to high five him as he briskly walked by to B stage after um and on the way back Jake tried fist bumping him uh and it was so much fun and honestly okay I didn't show the merch. This is the uh, brown hoodie. It has all the Canadian dates on the back. I don't know if you can see it. So initially we thought this like white font thing was going to be white press on or whatever, but it's kind of an, it's kind of neonish looking. And so at first I was kind of like, ah, cause I had pre-ordered the merch, but um, it's actually such good quality. Like this hoodie is thick. It's so thick, it's so cozy, and like after the show, I was literally freezing, and it started downpouring, and this was like literally the perfect merch piece to have gotten. So I'm happy about that. <sighs> I am so, so, so excited to see videos of the rest of the tour, and I wish I could go to more shows, but honestly, I cannot afford to, and um, so it goes. Uh, I know Noel will be back at some point in time, and we'll see how hard it is to get tickets at that point. I just remember back in the day it was so easy to get tickets tickets were sometimes free sometimes buy them day ad for 30 bucks and here we are now tickets are starting at like 300 dollars to go just to see noah so it's actually crazy i hope everyone gets a chance to see him live at some point because he is so talented and he really puts on a great show and like i just seen his confidence over the years grow and everything yeah, leaves me speechless a lot of the time. Um, but I'm so happy that was Noah's tour of We'll I'll Be Here Forever. Literally, he's been touring this album for almost like two years, three years now. Um, anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Um, I do have older Noah vlogs somewhere on my YouTube channel. I'll link it here, there, wherever. Go watch it. That was the last time we saw him at UBC um, for a similar tour. If you want set lists and stuff, Sammy ended up getting a set list too. Um, I'll ask her to send me a photo and I can put it here as well. But that's just for the Vancouver show. It could be a rotating set list. I have no idea. Yeah, but I'm so happy he got to do a Canadian tour too. So ah, I gotta go eat food. It's midnight and I literally have um, my first spin class tomorrow at like 8 a.m. 9 a.m. So wish me luck. Gotta work out tonight. That'll be good. Bye. Thanks for watching.